today we are doing some fun experiments with uh, ice. ice and Olaf. Noah. We have Olaf here today. He's very concerned about melting. So we're going to talk about that today and the different states of matter. So look at that. What's this, Alexi? Fire. That's water. It's water. And what state is it in? Do you know? Yeah, it's in the dark. <laughs> well, that's what it's in. That is true. But what state is it? State is when it's cold. It's liquid. Liquid. Yeah, it's wet. It's liquid. It's wet. You want to try it, Zoe? Oh, it's wet. Do you know what makes it a liquid? Liquids flow. You see how it changes when I turn the the direction? It moves to fit the container. It moves. It. it flows. That's pretty cool, eh? Yeah, and, and, and it could also go different yeah. sizes. It can switch around. Yeah, it's wet. So what are some other liquids that we have in our house? Water, water, milk, milk. Water, water, milk, milk. Basically things that we juice, drink. Juice, 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 juice. Water, water, milk, milk, juice, juice. Now what happens to water if we make it super cold and so we freeze it? Um, what um, happens cold. if I put this outside, Lexi? It, it turns to ice. Yeah, it turns to ice. Yeah, so let's take this ice cube out. There we go. Look. Ice cube. So, do you know what cubes? Is this the same as this? Is it the same stuff? Yeah. Yeah, it's water. Yeah. What happens if 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 we put it in the water? It turns back into water. That's right, because yeah. it warms up. So ice is frozen. So it's solid. Here. Everybody. It's solid. Lexi. Yeah. Which means it does not take the shape. If I take this ice cube and I put it in this heart shaped container, look, does it become a heart? Does it take the shape of a heart? Does it become a heart shape? Yeah. No, oh, look, it still stays like a cube. Look, if I take, watch. Put, put the water in the heart shaped container. If I put the water that comes out of this jar into this heart shaped container, does it become a heart shape in the bottom? Yeah. Yeah, does the ice do that? No. no. Let's put let's put all the ice in and see. If it put all the ice in the cube. In the container. Does it become a heart? No, it no. stays the same shape. Can you switch the the ice cubes around? No, they no, don't right? swirl. Look, they don't swirl. But that's still. Okay. When the water, the liquid water, goes outside in the cold, it freezes and becomes a solid. How does it turn back to water? Does it m m m? It melts, yeah. Melts. So if I leave this ice cube here for a few minutes, look what's happening already. It's, 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 it's melting. Yeah. yeah, see how it slides around? You want to push it around? Look at that. Wait. It's cold. That's cool, eh? I'm going to put the water in the kettle. We're going to put the water in the kettle. <laughs> in the ice. Okay, so we have some water here, we need a little bit of ice. We're gonna pour some. We don't need a lot, we're just gonna put a little bit. So we can do this, otherwise it's gonna take a long time. We're gonna turn it on. You wanna on. turn it on, Alexi? Yeah. Now you only do this with adult supervision, right? Yeah. So you just push, push it, down. it down. There. Blue. It's yeah. blue, yeah, it's, it's blue. blue. So we're gonna see what happens to the water. So the kettle has elements at the bottom. You see the little lines? Those are elements. Yeah. And it's gonna turn it, it's gonna heat up the water. Look at those little bubbles, Lexi. Do you see the little bubbles inside? Yeah. That's the water molecules getting all excited and moving around. What's that noise? That's the kettle. And then look, the water's moving around, it's swirling around, it's got bubbles. Do you see it underneath, Lexi? So what's going to happen to the water when it gets hot? Do so you see what's coming out of the top here? Steam! Steam! 
So when liquid water gets hot, it turns into steam. Steam, that's right. When it starts to boil, it turns to steam. Ooh, it's like a choo-choo train, flying like arrow. Yeah, it's steaming like a choo-choo train. Alexa, do you want to see steam turn back into a liquid? Yeah. We have a super cold baking sheet that we put in the freezer. See? Or a super cold baking sheet, and if you put it over top, turn this back on. Feel how cold it is, actually. Ooh. Put it over top, and it'll catch some of the steam. And the steam will condense yeah. and turn into, you'll get a little bit of water droplets. Stop it. Yeah. It's water. It's hot. It's warm, but it's water. That's cool, eh? We turn the steam back into liquid, because if we got enough of that, that would be like a cup of water. Whoa, look at all the liquid drops of water. That's cool. That's super cool. So, Alexi, when the, when the steam touch the pan and turn back into water, that's called condensation. Yo, yo now, the, now if I touch this side, then it feels like the splash pad. It's wet like a splash pad, you're right. Yeah. That's cool. Everyone, did, you got, uh, uh, I'm testing the ball of the molecules and it's that they hit splash pad. The molecules are acting like they do at the splash pad? Alexi, would you like to see what ice looks like under a microscope? Yeah. Okay. That's super cool. Do it. Let's do it. Yeah, I like your enthusiasm. That's when we get some more ice. There we go. Do you see the little air pockets and air bubbles? Yeah. Air pockets? Yeah, the little bubbles. And look, maybe you'll get to see it melting. Look what's happening. Do you see the water droplets as it melts? It's Do you see the little bits of water dripping off of the ice cube? Look. Yeah. Isn't that really cool? Yeah! <laughs> if you like what you saw, please subscribe to our channel and click on the bell to get notifications when we upload our latest videos. Give us a thumbs up and don't forget to leave us a comment. We'll see you next week for more activities, adventures, and lifelong learning. Bye! Bye.